God's Mercy, Seat, Scripture, Psalms 28, verses 1 to 5. I pray to you, O Lord, my rock. Do not turn a deaf ear to me, for if you are silent, I might as well give up and die. Listen to my prayer for mercy as I cry out to you for help, as I lift my hands toward your holy sanctuary. Do not drag me away with the wicked, with those who do evil, those who speak friendly words to their neighbors while planning evil in their hearts. Give them the punishment they so richly deserve. Measure it out in proportion to their wickedness. Pay them back for all their evil deeds. Give them a taste of what they have done to others. They care nothing for what the Lord has done or for what His hands have made. So He will tear them down, and they will never be rebuilt. This psalm begins with a desperate cry for help. The psalmist acknowledges the Lord as his rock, cries out for God's mercy, calls out the wicked, and prays that they will receive the consequences for their actions. Psalm 28 highlights the inconsistency between people's speech and their actions. This is a core component and manifestation of the spirit of deception in the world today, and highlights the need for discernment. Many times Christians are persuaded to believe a lie by those who speak friendly words to their neighbors while planning evil in their hearts. Many people are defrauded, sold into sexual slavery, seduced into sin, lured into an ungodly marriage, or conned out of their hard-earned money by people who appear sincere in their speech, but their hearts and intentions are evil. May the Lord help us to be alert, vigilant, and discerning in these last days, to recognize the devil, no matter how he disguises himself. May the Lord help us to hear the prompting of the Holy Spirit and be bold and courageous enough to say no to the lures, temptations, and lies of the enemy. Proclamation I proclaim that my eyes are upon the Lord. You, O Lord, are my shepherd. I hear your voice, and I follow you. A stranger's voice I will not hear. The Sovereign Lord has given me his words of wisdom and a well-instructed tongue to know how to speak the right word to the right person in the right situation. He wakens me morning by morning. He awakens my ear to hear and listen like one being instructed. He gives me discernment and opens my understanding of His will. Save your people, Lord. Lead us like a shepherd and carry us in your arms forever. Amen.